Hi, welcome back to Mark's Basement Arcade. Today we're going to work on Mini Pool. We are going to clean this bad boy out. Look how dirty this thing is. It's got bugs and everything. Here's a big old dead bug. Glass from broken bulbs. Just a bunch of junk in here. We're going to go through it and vacuum it all out. And this is going to be so much fun watching this. So as I vacuum it, I'm going to have it go fast forward so it looks kind of funny. Let's get the camera mounted up. And let's vacuum. You might want to know what's this thing this is like a computer keyboard cleaner type vacuum but it's great as you can see it to get into all the little tight little spots it just pops on and it's got a suction control here um, where it's not so much suction and then a lot of suction and then these little ends I have a, a bunch of them and they just pull off look at all that junk that's in there Wonder if it was no. Wonder if it was clogged even. Let's see. No, it wasn't clogged. It was just built up there. But yeah, it's got a bunch of different little attachments. I just plug in. It's got um. I don't know if you can see it through there. It won't fully close because it's going such as through a small little hole that um it might burn up your vacuum cleaner so this is adjusting on the fly as you need it 
So it's a pretty cool little thing. I think it was 10 bucks on eBay with free shipping. But as everybody knows, there's no such thing as free shipping on eBay. So, because you're, you're paying for the shipping. I don't care if they say it's free or not, you're still paying for it. I just got a couple of little things left to vacuum and then we're done. Okay, we're done with that. Now I'm just going to bolt this back down. Let's get um, three giant screws. This is like, out of all my pinball machines, it almost has the uh, least amount of junk in a cabinet. My Flight 2000, that has really nothing in the cabinet. It's got a big speaker. It's got a transformer. It's got, um, I think it's called the rectifier. And, um, really, that's about it. Let me get these screwed down and then we'll get the play field. Um, flashlight how clean it is now it's really pretty clean like I said this like hardly has anything on the inside this is where the play field plugs into and then another one goes up inside the back box As you can see, this is really clean underneath the play field. I almost don't want to sell this machine because it's in such decent condition. I mean, it's so clean. It's got, I don't think it's got a lot of plays on it, but there's no play counter and there's no change mechanism. So I can't really tell. I didn't like my Captain Fantastic. I think that machine says it's got like, I don't know, I think 94,000 plays on it. There, that's all connected. All right. The next half, I'm going to put the play field down and we're going to vacuum the top of the play field. All right, the top is vacuumed out. All good. I got some stuck dirt that I got to deal with here where it's real stuck. But I did take a little bit of Novus 2 to this area right here. It doesn't really show it too good. But just right in this area right here. You can see how it's glossier than the rest. I just wanted to see how it would turn out. I haven't waxed any bit yet. 
next video I'm going to show some waxing on it and how I clean the play field. So, thanks for watching. Like and subscribe. Share the video with your friends. Um, find us on Facebook at Mark's Basement Arcade. Next video, I will show you more of cleaning it, disassembly, and um, that should probably it for this game. And then we'll um, do a playthrough where I show you how it all works. Alright, thanks for watching. Have a good day.